welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to sex a chinchilla and tell whether it's male or female. This is Luna, she is my guinea pig for today. Now the reason why I think that some chinchillas are missexed is because females have a very prominent urinary papilla or urinary cone which can to some untrained eyes look like male parts when it in fact is a female. So the way that I generally sex them is if I was doing this on my own, I'd have the tail and bottom facing me and I would lift the tail up and have a look that way. Um, but because I'm doing it for you guys, I will do it the other way around with the tail facing the camera. So in order to sex them, I'd normally have their tail facing me, but because I'm doing it for the camera, I'm doing it the other way around. So apologies if it looks a bit awkward. And then I would just lift up the tail and as you can see there you've got the urinary comb and the anus are really quite close together almost touching that's a female so if you were doing this on your own i would have them in your lap or on a flat surface or even in the cage let's say and you just quickly lift up the tail ever so slightly and just see what you have that's it that's all you have to do you're not hurting her because she's got her front legs on, on your lap and your back legs, I'm supporting them as I lift up. So that's all I do. It takes two seconds to do. And look, she's fine. This is my male, this is Scooter. And I'll show you exactly the same thing as I've shown with Luna. Is I need to turn him around. As you can see, there is a very large gap between the penis and the anus. You see that? There's a much much larger gap in between the two and also because it is a mature male there is also testicles there as well just there. These two here testicles. There we are and you look closely there are two testicles there. Um, now, with male chinchillas, when they're not mature, the testicles may not be that easy to see. Some are, some aren't. It all depends. Yeah, if there's a huge gap in between, then it generally means that they're male. Um, some people have said online that males can have no gap in between, but I have never ever experienced that of any of my chinchillas. They've always had a gap, even if it's slightly smaller. Um, so the general rule is, if there's a gap, it's a chap. And if there's no gap, then it's a girl. 